being 100 percent transparent with you all right now sometimes i wake up and i want revenge and sometimes i want justice so it's both for me at this point in life i've seen, I've seen that she goes crazy whenever somebody speaks about her every single time it's like having you it's like you talking about getting married or, or you're married one or the other you know it's no i just want girlfriend no it's no I just want girlfriend. No, it's like, shit, are we getting married or are we not getting married? You know, getting married or are we not getting married? You know, it shouldn't be too many, too much in between. Because somebody that's trying to be, <laughs> right. mess, mess around and be dating for you, my girlfriend, for five years. No, mm -mm. dating for you, my girlfriend, for five years. No, because mm -mm. you got a nigga chasing for five years. <laughs> yeah, bitch. Gordon told her that he wasn't going to choose. And she so dated for three more he, years. He, he left it up to her to choose. Well, both of y'all, pretty much. If you want I would say both of us. Yeah. Okay. Mm -hmm. I mean, it took two to do what happened with us, you know? I got I didn't you. Just, I didn't just damn jump off the cliff for no reason. We did our dirt. Right. And, but the thing is, you don't disrespect my wife, though, you know? That's why I called her peasant at the beginning. Nobody knows that. He left the children in the restaurant with however many people was in the restaurant as babysitters to leave the restaurant and go and have an argument outside of this particular restaurant in Bridge Street with coleslaw. Uh I let her go on her rants, but she's upset with me about certain things. Let her do her thing, and then hopefully, you know, the, the light bulb will click off in her head and be like, I, I shouldn't be doing this. I'm not okay. fucking, I'm not profiting off of this much to be hurting my relationship with the father of my children, you know? I'm not profiting off of that much. It's not worth it, you know? Let me not make that sacrifice continuously. You know, like, I sent you some papers, right? I sent you some documents. No, you did before. not send me papers. You did not. I oh, thought oh, you told me you were going to send no, 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 no. them my, now. My, my, my pee, stop, I'm so sorry. My but I needed those papers to come no, from you. No, so no, do listen. I have permission, your permission to talk about those documents? No, listen. Oh, yeah, you have, you have permission. You have permission. So my PR sent you paperwork. I don't even, in terms of like discussing it or trying to say, oh, she was wrong on this, wrong on that. It's like, damn. It's like, I don't even like the back and forth, like right now or period. You know what I'm saying? Shut up. Shut up. Shut up. I did do my research because I was like, let me do my research to make sure I didn't miss anything. And, and, and regarding the papers that you're talking about, I searched high and low because I, I want to be factual. I want to be accurate. I did not hear yeah. her say anything about that particular, what we're talking about. If that mm -hmm. makes sense. I was like, let me go back. Let me pull up this interview. And I didn't hear her. I, actually, what I heard her say is we're not talking about that. She did like about four or five motions against me um, in terms of being an abusive father to my son. Um, in terms of abuse and stuff like that, it's like I've never been an abusive person. I've never harmed my children and nothing like that but let me ask you this do you want to talk about this knowing that the kids could see it because what i saw is what the child said and not melody and that's why i kind of want to steer away from this because i, no, I read so, so, so your listen, i read so what you say this here said. yeah so, so let me say this here so if i get either one of my children right here right now but you don't want to no 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 no, no, no. Gotcha. my kids not here I'm, it's a hypothetical if i got my children either one of them right here right now and i ask them a question i can manipulate them easily okay. yeah he said, he said, said, what? Mom was saying that you're like uh, cheating on her and stuff, but like during you guys' marriage, like getting. Yeah. I don't know. And she also said that uh, you keep getting like other girls pregnant and stuff. So. I didn't ask her anything. Mom told you that I keep getting other girls pregnant yes, and that I'll keep cheating on her? Yes, no, I'm a lie. Well, why'd she tell you that? No. Melanie. I don't know, because she's telling us to how we didn't realize when we get orders from things. And she like still kind of like tells us that something. Did you ask her any questions? She just came out and just told uh, she like she like sits down and talks to us separately, and then we, she also gives us a therapy, and she talks to our therapist to tell us how we feel about like not to be in different houses and how we fit and stuff like that. Do anyone else? If, if you uh, if your husband said that you abused your your child, I don't shit. You're not gonna have your children. You gonna be in jail or something like that too. For fifty six days, the judge took the kids away from me for fifty six days. We were filming, and then I filmed a scene with my um with my attorney talking about full custody. And then somehow, some way, Melody heard about that. And next thing you know, in December, um, my son had got like a scratch on his head. He and I, um, I was playing, we were playing around the table and stuff like that. Um, but I got on to him too, though. But he bumped his head on the table and scratched his little head. Um, and then, you know, instead of Melody giving me a call, she went straight to her attorney and, and said that I, I hit my son 25 times. I, la I gave him 25 lashes and also hit him upside the head with a um, back scratcher and made him bleed or whatnot. So she had me in court for that. And she didn't even call me to ask me what happened. So for 56 days, the judge took the kids away from me for 56 days. I did see the documents that your publicist sent over with your permission. 
I saw also, Martel, that they gave you a trespassing warning. I saw that you were no, no, sanctioned. I'm, 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 sorry, I'm sorry, I'm sorry, I'm sorry, I'm sorry. Don't say they. Our attorney. The attorney. Okay, but it was the court documents that was sent from your team. So it's, and also, um, you were sanctioned. That's why I didn't want to talk about it. Because no, 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 it's oh, okay. I, you know, I sent it. I sent it to my publicist and sent it to you because I'm very oh, transparent. Okay. Okay. It's not like it's not like my publicist went behind my back and got it sent to you. You know it, right? No, I don't. But that's oh, why. Okay. That's why. Oh, yeah. Okay. So, so okay. yeah, she sent. I sent it to her to send to you. I am an open book. I'm very transparent. Okay. It's the reason for all of that. So the reason that I was sanctioned is monetary only. Money. She said that only thing is because I didn't want to go to um, counseling. I'm like, why I gotta go to counseling? Because. Um, it all happened when Melody said that um, I hit my son 25 times. I didn't see that. I, well, I saw, no. oh, hold on, hold on, hold on. It didn't say, I didn't see the part where it says Melody said. It said the child said, and it gave an accurate, in parentheses, right? Where the child quoted to the doctor, where the child quoted what was going on. Thinking about it, something totally different. You about to talk about the, um, like the punch on the arm or something like that. That's what you about to talk about. So that's, that's totally different. But it still happened. No, no, no. No, no, I'm saying it's still totally different what you're saying, what I'm talking about, something totally different. Right. So the twenty the twenty five lists is something totally different than what you're about to, to speak on. Yeah. Okay. But it's still right. it's still kind of in the arena of what you're talking about. And okay, so, judge... so regardless so regardless of what, you know, we went to court for everything and it was never found that I abused my child or my children. Period. Well so what they ordered you to do is to go to therapy and work yeah. with the guys. So so oh so so yeah, so that was in the beginning. That's why I was sanctioned because I'm like, for well, what? You know, um, so this happened at the beginning when, you know, it was more of like, uh, Marta, you struck the kid 25 times. That's when my children was taken away from me for 56 days. And that was before they even heard um, my side or what really happened. It just immediately took the kids. <laughs> Why did you lose trust in Arion when she shared with Carson what you and Melody had going on in your own private marriage? Did that make you feel some kind of way that Arion would share that with Carson, that other girl that appeared on Love and Marriage Huntsville? How did you feel about that? Oh, what, what did you, oh, I'm so sorry. What did she share with Carson? You know what she shared now. Don't play with me, Martel Hope. Okay, it almost like you're talking about yeah. something different than what I know. Okay, I don't, what hit oh, the so, internet? How did you feel about Arion taking your private marriage business to, to, to somebody she met on the internet? That had to made you have feel some kind of way. You, you know, so, certain people are, are opportunists and they'll say and do whatever they can to, to get in and make them seem like they're a really, really good friend or something like that. And people just, other people, like they open up trusting that, that those people or that person that they are who they say they are. You follow what I'm saying? Yeah. I guess she knew I wasn't lying, but probably was trying to come up with an angle or way to discredit me. So, um, and again, I, I don't think that, I think that Carson a lot about things too, but I don't think that, well, I know that, well, I take it back. How do you feel about Arion discussing your marital business and what you have with your ex-wife with a complete stranger? I, I'll be real, I mean, that's disappointing, you know? I mean, yeah. everybody make mistakes. Everybody make mistakes. So, um, I'm just gonna leave it right there. Yeah. But uh, did you have a conversation about the way that backfired on you? Because it's not good right now. Did you sit um, down and say, listen, when I talk to you about what's going on, you know, and I'm sharing with you as a woman, you know, then what, however long that was, that's not for you to go to somebody else as so a man. Listen, so listen, um, this happened over a year and a half ago. Mel and I, we talked about it a year and a half ago. We talked about it with Carlos a year and a half ago, and we talked to our attorneys about it. So my thing is, Carson, I saw her, her live, whatever. And she mentioned, she referenced Melody about three times on there. Was it two or three? You, I think you know. You, 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 you do know how many times she Keep referenced? going. I'm, I'm following. I'm trying to process. Okay, so, so, so she, re she referenced Melody about two or three times. So I'm like, how is she so for certain that Melody got this information? Unless you already talked to Melody. And make it seem like there's no way that I could be telling the truth. As far as, I don't know what she could. I mean, that's what I said. I mean, whatever she wanted to come. Come. Go ahead. Tell, show your receipts. Like, what? What receipts could you have there? 59 weeks. So this was 59 weeks ago. General guys, we're, we're going to scroll all the way up. These are our DMs. And mind you, I, <laughs> y'all, cause y'all, y'all YouTubers, y'all gonna, y'all gonna get the tea and go do what y'all need to do. Y'all gonna have the receipts and dates and all this. I can't make this up, y'all. This right here, boop. She asked me to go to a comedy show. I cashed up for the money for it. In here. She asked me to go. This is me, her, her, her responding. This is, this is the child. Her asking me, she said, hey girl, what are you doing on the 25th? Me, 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 me. And so again, if anything, Ariane could only have said, um, Martel um, is really upset and he's talking about um, putting out a, um, a sex tape of Nelly or something like that. I and then you even went as far as saying, but the video is of them. He's mad at me. He feels like I should just listen. Like, come on now. 
so arrogant and go to her and say that Martell's talking about me creating a fake page and want me to post. Like, why would I need her to create a fake page and post one? Did you perform fellatio with, um, on, on, on a man? So I'm what? gonna be real specific. Somebody performed it on me. You told me that you did it. I got the recording. I got the recording. I got the recording. I got the recording. I can create a fake page and post it. But then she was sounding a little distressed. Huh. Martell wants me to make a fake page and post as a guy and post a video of Melody giving him head, but wants me to act like I'm a different guy. Go ask her that. So let me finish, though. You know what I'm saying? But how do you dad, feel about Arion just talking too much and oversharing? Sometimes I'm not, I'm not, I'm not, I'm, you know, I'm not, I'm not, I'm not worried about that. You know? At all. Um, so, so some people, you know, they make mistakes, you know, I've, um, I've, that's taken care of. And some people just make mistakes. If we enjoy this, let's sit down and talk about it and let that be it. If I do something that you don't like, call me. Don't go to social media. That's what, I, that's what I'm trying to tell her. Like, you didn't have to go to social media if you heard something. Call me. Because if I did, I'll come to you and we can talk about it. You know what I'm saying? I don't. Okay, we're going to start with this. Here's an instance where Slarion, his raggedy ass baby mama, took to social media and didn't call his raggedy ass and let him know that she felt like her son, baby Slaw, was an outsider. Everybody makes mistakes. That's what I'm talking about. Everybody does. Did you or did you not? Okay. Um, so, but that's beside the point. The, the, the major point is, you know, Melody could have called me opposed to going online. Uh-uh, that's, that's not her responsibility. No, no, no. Let's no, not no. do yeah. that. That's not her responsibility. Are you okay, son? My son got sick from his sibling, unfortunately. He's not in daycare. He doesn't start daycare until August, so he got sick from being around his sibling. If Arion no, is having, no, no. hold on, if Arion is having, let's not do that, because that's not your responsibility. If somebody's telling Melody, it's not your responsibility. If Arion is having oh, a oh, conversation. This is over a year and a half ago. Never. If Arion is having a conversation that you don't know she's having, and Melody yeah. doesn't know she's having, you're both over here. That is not Melody's right. responsibility to pick up the phone, no. to call you about what Arion is doing. You don't even no, know. So I guess, no, you, you, you're, not, you're not understanding what I was saying. I'm, I, I'm following you. Okay, what, what I'm saying is, when, when Carson went live mm -hmm. and, I, and I feel that if it, if it wasn't if it wasn't orchestrated by I don't know by Melody and Carson I don't know because again Carson mentioned Melody's name two or three times saying that Melody y'all go ask Melody I'm pretty sure she got the tape or Melody got something so if y'all think I'm lying what y'all should do the same way y'all been harassing me is go ask Melody do you have a video giving your husband head and I'm like damn they must have orchestrated something hey boo I don't have any plans I'll be in town for a couple of days and y'all have a comedy show on the 25th. I want to go. I'm about to send you the guy page. Everybody said he's funny. I've never even been to a comedy show on Hunts Girl, y'all, ever. Me? <laughs> okay, let's go. She sent me the guy page, whatever. I don't care who he is. And then she like, okay, perfect. The ticket's on his website link. I'm about to buy one. They only like $27. Me, buy mine, I'll cash app or zeal you. Okay, send me your information. Then she sent me her cash app. I'm buying them now. I'm sending it now. So y'all can see. <laughs> let's, let's go to the top. Okay. So I probably start no, like knew of her, um, didn't meet her until August, but July 2021 was our first, like the first time she hopped in my DMs. I posted something. And as a matter of fact, y'all seen this post. Honestly, never trust a nigga with a baggy watch. Um, once. Carson did all her stuff. I feel that Melody could have called me then. And, and Martell, what did you share with Ariel? Oh. And coming back from Florida, I was opened up to drama that I ain't been opened up to and I don't know how long because I really mind my business, stay in my world. And to be quite clear, I have stayed away from you. Don't hold me accountable for, for someone else being disrespectful. But Melody can't hold me accountable because someone else is acting immature and things of that nature. I am going to hold you accountable the same way. Yo, I'm going to hold you accountable why, why the same you way. I was, I'm going to hold you accountable why, why the same you way. I was, for someone else's I'm going to hold you accountable the same way that I held you accountable all the years in my marriage that I was disrespected by this person, and then you went and had a baby with him and kept with him, even though they kept disrespecting your wife. Holds too going online, dragging me, making making me seem like I actually. She didn't drag me. She said, there's a tape. I listened to it. I heard her say, because I like to listen in the bushes. And she, she said, there is a tape that doesn't exist. She, she drugged me. She don't know, she don't know if there's a video that, that exists. She doesn't know that. She did. I, 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 I sent her a screenshot. So there was a video alive that he did where he literally talked about the case and came for me. And I responded to that live. Things of that nature. So I just want to just come on and, and really just talk about I guess some of the things going on. 
this is the criteria. Like, we have to limit the babysitters. Um, again, guys, it's like 20, 20, 23 plus babysitters. Whenever I responded to that live, he sent me a screenshot of the video from the video. And I know the video. I remember where we were. I did. I sent, okay. her, screen, I sent her a screenshot um, of, of, of her and I. I did. I sent her a screenshot. And I sent you. Did you see that, that text message in your phone? I mean, that uh, my PR sent to you? There were so many images. I got to no, as many. No, no, no I'm, I'm sorry, but it, it was a, a text message. It was only one text message. And I sent it to you for. The, I sent. I'll, I'll send you okay. all these documents for a particular reason. And I asked my PR if you had seen it all. She told me if you've seen it all, because when I when I talk, I want you to be able to be like refer to. Go ahead. It. Yeah. Go ahead. Um. So the text message, I, I was telling you that I said stop bullying me. Um, okay, know, I saw that. I saw that. Right. Go ahead. Like I was begging her like to, to like to stop going online, saying stuff about me and, and, and dragging me. And this was like a year and a half ago. I was like begging I her remember. Like, to stop, I to saw stop that. bullying me. You know what I'm saying? And I, I think on her interview, she she mentioned that, but I'm like, dang, if I'm up here begging you to stop bullying me, I could not have gone live before that and dogging you out. No, I was begging you to leave yeah. me alone. And then I sent her a screenshot and I told her, I said, um, I said, I don't I don't care if this ruined me or not. I said, leave me alone. You know what I'm saying? I sent her the screenshot. And I never said I was gonna post a video. I never said that I was gonna do that, but I guess it kind of, it was saying that if you don't stop, I'm going to do that. You know what I'm saying? I do, you know. No, okay. Yeah, that's okay. it. Why do you think that Ariana or Carson would make that up? Or Ariana would make up the fact that there is a tape or, or a video? Or, 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 or Carson would make it up. Only How would she know Arianne that? Just, only because Ariana mentioned it. I, I don't know. I got you. I mean, Ariana could have just mentioned that Martell's talking about a sex tape, whatever. And then Carson trying to get on the show, which she's not going to get on. She's trying to get on the show. And now she's calling Melody. Hey, I'm going to make plot of something. I don't, I don't know. These... They're good at what they do. And y'all couldn't get her to discuss the tape. That's the issue at hand. But they're trying. This is what they're trying to do. At the end of the day, what they're trying to do is basically distract y'all from what happened, what she said, Martel said to her, what is actually going on. Never, I, I never said I'm going to put a video out. A video isn't out. No one told me not to put it out. A judge, and, I mean, we mentioned, she mentioned in court. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? But, I mean... I never put nothing out. Never said I was going to put anything out. You know what I'm saying? So it's like, why even go online crying or or making it seem like I did it or something? I have not. Well, it's not her I, fault. I, I, would not, I would not have done it. You know what I'm saying? I would not have done it. And this was a year and a half ago. We've already talked about it. If anything, it should have been more like, hey, we've already talked about it. I'm not even going to make it seem like this well, she, It's not about you and her. And I think you're missing that. It's about Arion telling somebody else. I think you and Melody were clear. No, so no. It's, it's about Carson going on live. Mm -hmm. No, it's about Carson going on live, putting stuff out. It's not, about, it's, 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 it's not about we're a friend. You act as if you're a friend, right? You act as if you're a friend. You spend like you're a friend. You was a fake friend. You was an opportunist. And now you're trying to jump on the TV show, being an opportunist. It's clear as day. And I hate it. She won't be on the show. She won't. I don't care. So she. Yeah. But Ariane reached out to her, she said. So how no, was she an opportunity? No, no, no. I mean, how do you real? know that, Martel? You no, don't, women get on the phone. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Because women get on the phone and they can talk. I'm a woman. I'm telling you. Women I'm be saying. talking about shit that men don't even know. <laughs> I so, know. Trust me. So I'm how saying. are you so sure of what this girl so sure. said? I'm not so Thank sure. you. I'm not so sure. Okay. Uh, Martel wants me to make a fake page and post as a guy and post a video of Melody giving him head but wants me to act like I'm a different guy. I said, what? I'm like, what? She said, Martel wants her to create a fake page acting like a guy and to upload a video of Melody. Actually, he's, she's actually giving her husband head in the video. But she, I, I'm assuming, now I did not see this video, okay? But I'm assuming, what I am assuming is that Martel must not be in the video. If he felt comfortable enough to even ask her to do this, he must not be in the video. Yeah. It's just entertainment purpose. Oh, it's not. Yeah. It's just entertainment purpose. Oh, it's not. Yeah. In, the, in the case of anybody. It's just entertainment purpose. Oh, it's not. Yeah. In